What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Strike Up Beer. Quick beer reviews with your pals, Alan and Rapid Dave. I'm Rapid Dave. I'm Alan. What's up, buddy? Not much. How you doing? Uh, gonna be doing a lot better after I get okay. this in my my stomach. Put this in my mouth. That's all. <laughs> I wanna... <laughs> That's all you want to do. Today we have 903 Brewers. Uh, where in the world? And obviously, it looks like uh, Where in the World is Carmen San Diego, which is a great show. We were talking about that earlier, and I love the game and as well. Video game. Yeah. Um, now this is a lager with pineapple and jalapeno. You're saying that weird. A lot of words. Go ahead. Yeah, you're saying that. Uh, So a zippy pineapple and earthy jalapeno dynamic globe trot throughout this light lager. Delicate malts and hops. Roundabout? No, no, no. Rendezvous? Rendezvous with a clean (laughs) fermentation profile to boldly feature a vibrant blend of tropical pineapple and peppery jalapeno. Uh, Bright, fruity, acidity. Ignites the senses while jalapeno additions steal the show with a finish of peppery flavor without heat. The result is an exhilarating yet approachable combination of flavors atop an easy drinking lager. 4.5% alcohol by volume. NA on the IBUs. Average score of 3.66 out of 5 out of 88 ratings on untapped. That pineapples makes it smell really real juicy too. That's So that's what I'm reading is like you... You smell a lot it, of pineapple. It, it, it looks like pineapple. It tickles taste. your nose with the pineapple, yeah. but then it sucks you in the mouth with the jalapeno. You were you the way you were describing it. You sound like uh, what's his name from uh, uh, <laughs> Ron Burgundy. <laughs> yeah. it stings the nostrils. Stings. <laughs> All right, cheers to you. There mazel, you go. mazel. Right, got to lock it in. Lock it in. Oh, that's good. That's damn good. It's got fruity with just a hint of heat. The heat goes away almost immediately. It, now, what I've noticed with jalapeno is that the more we drink it, the more the further it's no, going to get down our throat. Yeah, 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 yeah. The warmer it gets. So to me, that says I'm just going to chug the rest of it, um, so I don't let it just keep building up. Right. <sighs> There's been a lot of. Uh, you probably won't get it because of the pineapple. Pineapple will probably. Take away a lot of that sting, but there's been a lot of beers in the uh, the Metroplex, the DFW Metroplex, that they've introduced uh, jalapenos to just a regular colches or lagers right. and things like that. And I'm telling you, it really does step it up. And then with the pineapple on this, this thing it is really pretty hits damn you with good. a fruit smell, like especially like just before you take a drink, mm-hmm. as you're you're going to take the drink, it just <sighs> wafts right in your nose. You're like, oh, right here we go. And then you take a drink. You're like, that's not what I smell. I picked this up as a single. Um, they're out of Sherman, Texas, Texas, by the way. Canada. Uh, 903. The Canada is what they call it. Um, but yeah, I picked up this single can from uh, Lone Star Beverages right down the street in Carrollton. And, you know, just go in there and pick, 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 pick. And, you know, just grab me a bunch of little rando cans. But uh, this one jumped off because I saw the, the Carmen San, San Diego, Diego thing. So five out of five on the can art. And uh, as we're going here. Oh, did you say it pairs well with? Did you get to that? No, it, I don't have that here. Oh. It's on the can. I meant to, I was going to say this too. Let's yeah. see. Uh, pairs well with smoke, <laughs> smoked fish dip. Corn ribs and international travel. I don't know about the first two, but yeah, international travel. I don't travel. even know what corn ribs are. <laughs> like, like, is it supposed to be corn, comma, ribs? Corn ribs. That's what it says. What are corn ribs? You should Google it. You're the one Hey, Siri. No, come on. What are corn ribs? You're going to set my phone off. Now my phone's like bogging down. No. All right. Here's your chance to chug it because we're almost done. All right. Yeah, All right so slam it. Chug slam it. it. Yeah, she's still listening to us. So just a little bit of the flavor of the jalapenos in there, the little, little touch of the heat. The pineapple really does come out in this beer. Uh, makes it, like you said, just real juicy, crushable. I mean, just through the roof crushability. For me, the pine not the pineapple, but the, the jalapeno is kind of overpowering for mm-hmm. me. That's the that's the flavor profile I'm picking up the most out of it. Okay. Um, the smell is pineapple, but the taste is the jalapeno. Mm. Uh, smooth, though. It, it actually is really smooth, which, I mean, it is a lager. Right. So it, it definitely needs to be smooth. Um, but all in all, not awful. Yeah. You know. Check it out um, and let us know because, yeah, no, I'm a I'm definitely a thumbs up. I know he doesn't like heat, but when I saw it had jalapeno in it, I bought it just because of that. Yeah. And, and <laughs> not liking jalapeno, I was okay with drinking one, right? Like, am yeah, I going to go buy it again? No. Yeah. But yeah. that's that's not my style. That's not what I like. Mm-hmm. But I will drink one because I don't. When it comes to beer, I'll try anything. We're drinking them all till we try them yeah. all, I guess. I we don't treat know. them like Pokemon. We got to catch them all. <laughs> I think of that guy. I mean, if they're serious, they are. I mean, if they want to <laughs> catch them all, they got to catch <laughs> Like I'm trying to do. <laughs> Still trying to get my hands on that punchy rock. <laughs> but 903 Brewers, guys, go check them out. Great brewery, great location. 
great food. Oh yeah. Uh, amazing beer. Awesome guys out there. Uh, but thanks for watching. As always, I'm Alan. Rabbit Dave. Talk to you guys later. Deuces.